And I'm so glad you're mine Princess, yeah. my angel, my queen Baby, you're my, my friend. friend Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel So first things first, if you are new here First off, welcome Rain gang, welcome back for another video. So we are doing something a little bit different, switching it up, doing a get ready with me. So this is what I would do like if I was going somewhere or if I was getting ready to work, aka film a video, um, etc. So I'm just taking you guys through what I'm doing, but I also want to show you guys the stars of the hour and how I created um this Instagram look that y'all see right here. So since some of y'all asked, I'm gonna break it down and show y'all the simplicity. But first things first. <laughs> that bless me. Listen, people, I'm churchy and I'm goofy and I will not apologize for it. Anywho, I'm fresh out the shower as it says on the screen. I am doing my skincare products. And then we're going to move on to introducing to y'all the stars of the hour. Hello, y'all. I'm taking it back to Ampro Pro Style. I used to use this all the time back in the day, but they have a CBD line. So this is their CBD oil hair cream. And basically, y'all, it's just a deeply conditioning, deeply moisturizing, vegan and gluten-free hair cream okay calm and relax your frizzy wire resistantly stiff hair with the intoxicating effects of castor oil vitamin e omega 369 and almond extract now this stuff smells amazing and it's also emollient rich which just pretty much means emollients are just in your products to trap in the moisture so with that being said i like to apply some of my products emphasis on some of my products <laughs> directly outside of the shower and this is just going to seal in all of that moisture still damp inside of the shower or, or I'm sorry the bathroom and it just works I do not manipulate my curls during this process I just use a praying hand method especially because of the style that we will be creating together then I go ahead and plop my shower cap back on just to trap in the moisture while I do my my makeup and you know change my clothes and whatnot and so forth and so on and there's that so it's pretty easy shower you know skincare brush your teeth get yourself together okay and then we're gonna go ahead and do our makeup now if you have not known is this video is sponsored by Ampro, so y'all know that means. Where you get a coin for that? I so like it. All right. <laughs> oh God, we thank you. Anywho, so with that being said, we're just going to focus on the stars of the hour, which is the Ampro line. So I will not be showing you guys exactly what I'm using, you know, for legal reasons. Okay. Um. So if you guys are interested in seeing my makeup routine, I do have videos. Not much has changed at all. I still use the same exact product. So if you're interested, please make sure to go ahead and check out that playlist um, and all of that information will be there for you. But I still wanted to include everything in my get ready um, video. So let's talk about brows. Okay, if you've been following me for some time and you're a supporter, you know, I don't play about my brows. Okay, they're typically like 98% will be done. Um, so I typically will fill my brows in first and then I line. That works for me. Um, but I'm a big, big, big brow person. And so I tend to really focus on that and then we're gonna go ahead and highlight I don't always highlight sometimes I'll just leave a concealer of my complexion but I really wanted to highlight um, because of the look that I'm going for typically I'm using the word typically a lot today but it's okay um, I will use a sponge to or a beauty blender to go ahead and blend but I want more of a color payoff. I really want it to really stand out and to be very highlighted. And what I find works is using what God gave us. Come on, somebody. What God gave us is in our fingers. Um, the warmth to the finger really helps to blend that in. And then whatever just needs more blending, I will take a brush instead of a, um, a beauty blender. And that works for me for whatever, you know, style I'm going for. It really pays off really well. Um when you're taking your pictures it stands out so if you've never tried that which i'm sure you guys have but just in case you know and then i love a good contour you know what i'm saying like let's cinch me in a little bit jesus you know um so yeah i like to go ahead and contour and i'm just using a powder base um just darker powder to contour i typically don't buy contour related type of products that are meant to contour i don't need that really i just find a darker powder that works for me and i'm pretty simple with my makeup again this 
may not be, you know, simple for everybody, you know, it's, it's okay. And it may be a very, very simple, according to the Jackie Ines of the world, because we know Jackie just say beat and she just be bomb, you know what I'm saying? So, but you know what? You got to do what works for you, okay? So we are going to go ahead and set our under eye, um, and I typically use the same setting powder. I like a yellow-based setting powder not so much a translucent it just depends on the day i like to go ahead and pat my brows because i tend to get really oily in those areas and then i follow up with a powder that's just very light powder just to kind of knock off the shine and to really blend everything and fuse it all together so y'all let me just say this real quick your girl is putting on falsies for y'all. Y'all hear me? No. Y'all not don't do this. Oh my god. Y'all know I'm not a big falsie person. I I don't. You know, I just prefer my own uh, lashes, but it's nice to switch it up. And I felt like getting real cute today, okay? <laughs> Might delete later. No, I'm just playing. I can't because it's sponsored. Praise God. Anywho, we're going to go ahead and set it all together. And I like to go ahead and dry because I can't find my fan. All right. So our face is done. Our hair is prepped. We're moving on to the cognac oil styler. Okay, this is free of alcohol, parabens, and fragrance and gluten-free. Provides an extra hold while being vegan and conditioning your hair with vitamin E, aloe, and cognac oil. So I was like, cognac oil? Okay, so I have to research my ingredients. And I found that cognac oil is really good to have in your hair and increases volume and makes your hair softer and shinier and healthier looking. I mean, hello, that's dope. Okay, so anywho, this is the styler of choice because it does have a heavy like consistency to create this style. So in order to create this look, I need a heavy gel and this is a heavy gel. So I'm also going to be using the Shine and Jam Edge Magic because why not just stick with Amp? Pro, right okay it's an Ampro video all right so now that my hair has been kind of sitting in the moisture with the cream on top of it let me just show y'all something okay do y'all see the definition huh, huh, hello hello okay hello do, do you, okay um so pretty much not manipulating my hair not brushing not raking but just simply smoothing is allowing me to keep the curls that I would have in the shower and keep my hair soaking wet um so all you need is a rat tail comb if you want perfect parts i don't care and it's crunchy that's it now if you have thicker hair than mine or more dense hair you definitely might want to try to use less hair in the front and more hair in the back so i'm taking a good half chunk but you can go ahead and take less because our focal point is going to be the front part of the hair and because we do have shrinkage with you know having natural hair you do want to minimize that as much as you can without manipulating your hair so using less hair in the front might be beneficial so we are moving on to the setting mousse okay mousse has been working in my favor in the last few styles and I'm not mad okay so what I've learned with mousse for me because I did not manipulate my hair I want my curls to stay put okay there's they they trifling so I need for them to stay put what I find is mousse really grabs hold to my strands and it's going to set my curls and my natural curls from the shower no manipulation in place okay but i need to follow up with the heavy styler so of course i'm using the cognac oil style of the star of the show okay and it's a heavy gel so heavy gels give my hair weight and for this controlled wet look style i definitely need weight to my hair also i need definition okay so layering my products works for me and my hair um, I just need the extra weight but something that's not going to be oily plus definition okay I'm also applying the gel to the perimeter of my hair which is going to give me hold and shine before I add the edge magic I need just extraness because I'm creating this wet you know fresh out the shower pool look so i need multiple products on my hair okay and i need a certain type of technique and of course from doing my hair for years i just kind of know technique and style and uh you know when to put what on and so forth so that is what i'm doing now my hairline look a little filled in i'm not mad okay I, i'm really not um okay i see but anywho i told you guys over on instagram that this style was super simple it just takes a lot of steps to create that wet look because naturally curly hair wants to shrink upwards and what i'm trying to do is do the opposite so 
I'm creating my ponytail, which is self-explanatory. However, I'm trying to add height, and you'll see why. Um, so we're taking it real back. Like, I would say, what, 90s maybe? You know what I'm saying? Um, so, again, y'all, I have to con I, I have to keep putting on product. And the good thing is I'm not using a whole lot because I don't have to. The mousse kind of did half of the job. And then the uh, styler is just giving me the definition and the weight that I need. But I am reapplying some more because I want this portion to hang. Um, and I'm going to take a portion in the back to wrap around my uh, scrunchie. And y'all, this is what <laughs> this is what be giving me that cute style, that character to your style it's such a simple cute style and wrapping this around your scrunchie just gives everything that you need like the shine just makes it look so polished and just very very cute and i guess semi trendy i don't know but i like it and i think it's super cute so we got that out the way i hope that was uh, you know i hope y'all understood what i was saying i hope that you know helped in any way but yeah, that's how I get that part of my hair to, you know, act right. Now, I'm going to be completely honest. With the back portion of my hair, I can use all the mousse in the world. I can use all the gel in the world. My hair is curly. It's going to <laughs> shrink up. It's not going to give me the wet look the whole day. Um, it will give me very uniform and defined curls, but I did experience shrinkage. So, I mean, that's just inevitable. Correct? Correct. However, using the mousse, using the gel really gives me the definition and the shine that I'm going for. So even when my hair shrunk, it was fine. Also, if you want to minimalize that, definitely do your hair in more sections. I tend to do more sections when I'm doing my wash and goes, but because it's like a quick get ready with me, I'm just showing you guys exactly what I did for my photo, and I didn't do that many sections, maybe four. I didn't really concentrate on my roots like I typically would, and if I would have, you know, did smaller sections and really raked in the product, really smoothed in the product, I probably wouldn't have got that much shrinkage. This is something to consider if you are a little you know pressed about shrinkage try smaller sections for a more elongated look my hair stayed the same it just got a little bit shorter and that was fine by me but what definitely helps is creating or putting your clips in the back because my hair does expand so while it was drying that really helped to keep it kind of controlled but y'all that's pretty much it so if you're interested in these products go ahead and check it out at your local beauty supply store or hair to beauty.com i'll leave everything down below in the description box for you to check out so this is a cute 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 summer style it's easy it's gonna air dry because it's gonna be hot outside and all that jazz so i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you laughed i hope you were entertained i hope you learned something again check everything down below in the description box also thank you ampro for sponsoring this video because your girl been using ampro for years so that ain't nothing but a blessing okay thank you guys so much for watching and i love you guys and i'll see y'all in my next video. Bye y'all.